really important to me to have good representation on the city council. I think that he will bring logic and professionalism. I believe he will be willing to hear and advocate for the concerns and issues the residents of the 4th District have. Um, for those that have been here for a very long time and for those that are newly arrived and for the growing diverse population um, that the 4th District has. I have known Dan for most of his life and can attest to his character and his willingness to serve the citizens of the 4th District and all the citizens of the City of Independence. We first met Dan Hobart in January at a candidate forum and we were able to listen to him discuss his views and offer intelligent solutions on various issues that are now confronting our city. We were favorably impressed by Dan's responses and ideas and believe that he would be a huge asset to the City Council. We believe Dan is the clear choice to represent the 4th District. Please. Just wanted to encourage you to support Dan Hobart in the 4th District. He has several characteristics that I think would be beneficial to the City of Independence. One of those is that you put the city's interests above your own. Secondly, you need to pick someone that does not have an ax to grind, that has things that they want to see changed in the city, because a lot of times that's the only thing they're focused on, and it's usually a personal agenda. Thirdly, it's important for a person to be able to work across the aisle, to work with other people. And they have to learn, they have to understand how the city works, and then they have to put partisanship aside and do what is best for the city of Independence. Dan Hobart has the innate ability to look at all sides of a given question and make informed, independent, objective decisions. Dan knows and understands the needs and the strengths of the 4th District. On the council, he will bring integrity and good judgment and servant leadership, which are qualities so badly needed. Hi, I'm Dan Hobart, and I'm running for City Council for the 4th District in Independence. The vote is next Tuesday. It's June 2nd, folks, so I hope everybody can get out and uh, exercise that right. If you feel unsafe or otherwise can't make it, I feel terrible for you because it's painful for folks that are interested to not be able to do that. The Jackson County Election Board has said that there are uh, measures in place to protect people. Check their website. The polling places have changed. Check their website. And whatever you do, do the best you can. And I sure appreciate your support if you can get out and do it.